I'm Barry Kane, American. Right now, I'm a fugitive. A couple of days ago, I was an aircraft worker. Then something happened. My best friend died in that fire. The authorities questioned everybody. I told them what I knew. There were two detectives here a moment ago. They wanted to arrest you. They said that you killed him. You don't know what it is to be hunted like an animal. To dread every door you open. To fear everybody. Even the one girl you could love. Even if a man committed murder to defend himself, maybe I wouldn't tell the police. But there's only one reason why a man commits sabotage. That's worse than murder. We fled through 3,000 miles of terror from Los Angeles to New York. Step by step, the whole vast pattern of sabotage became clear to us. We had to find those saboteurs. Well, we found them. And we almost wish we hadn't. Before they get to us, go out and stop the music and tell them. Tell them all. Honey, this is the Sutton Mansion. I'm just a guy from Glendale, California, wanted by the police. They'll grab me as soon as I open my mouth. What are you going to do? We can't just stand here. made that print is about 10 times the size of a normal man. What happens to our world if massive, monstrous man beasts like this invade us? Flown a captive to a West Coast metropolis in an army cargo plane, his arrival catapults the whole city into an ocean of fear. For this colossal beast is at war with the world, our world. A world his savage instincts can only hate. An airlift is being set up and food will be parachuted down to him. He'll be supplied with everything he needs. Get all the aircraft into the air at once. man is loose in Los Angeles. Look! Look at the giant! Panic grips the civilized world in blood-freezing horror as the immeasurable power of this colossal beast threatens a war of brutality such as we've never known. <laughs> 